two hurricanes forecast to hit the U.S. Gulf at the same time in unprecedented weather event. When storms orbit each other, the speed of one can accelerate the other as part of something known as the Fijiwara effect. It's pretty huge, uh... Harvey was a huge storm. A pair of tropical cyclones forecast to become hurricanes early next week are headed for the U.S. Gulf Coast in what would be an unprecedented weather event that could change that could cause major damage. Tropical Storm Laura and a separate tropical depression brewing near Honduras may make landfall as hurricanes in an area stretching from Texas to Florida panhandle the National Hurricane Center says it would be the first time two cyclones have entered the US Gulf of Mexico since 1959 and meteorologists say two storms have covered have coverage in the Gulf simultaneously on only a very small number of occasions. And while a Category 3 hurricane and a moderate top tropical de- storm hit the U.S. Gulf of Mexico together in 1933, there are no records of two hurricanes occurring in the same basin at the same time. However, meteorologists say there's still or there is still considerable uncertainty around how the systems may develop and move in coming days, particularly as they cross land. Dan Katolowski of AccuWeather said the storm or the two storms currently look on track to remain separate but that at any interaction between the two could change their intensity or trajectory he said it was unlikely the two would combine but added more than likely will become more than likely one will become stronger and in fact inflict more vertical wind shear causing the other to weaken. But if they stay of equal strength, then they will probably prevent each other from getting really strong. David Sturrett of Commodity Weather Group said that sometimes when storms interact, they can orbit each other. And the speed of one cyclone can accelerate the other. This is part of something known as the Fijiwara effect. Tropical storm Laura is currently east of the Antilles and was upgraded from a depression on Friday. With sustained winds of 45 miles per hour, It is forecast to make landfall as a hurricane on Wednesday in an area spanning Louisiana to Florida Panhandle. Tropical Depression 14, which would be named Marco if it strengthens, is on course to make landfall on Tuesday near the Texas-Louisiana border. That day would mark the three-year anniversary of Hurricane Harvey which battered parts of Houston with 50 inches and causing billions of dollars in damage. Tropical Depression 14 doesn't look robust right now, but it looks to be in an environment conductive to strengthen, says Phil Kolodzbach, a research scientist at Colorado State University. Mr. Kolowski added that Tropical Depression 14 would likely become the stronger storm because it was on track to pass over a relatively flat area of the 
Yucatan Peninsula before gaining strength after entering the warm waters of the Gulf of Mexico.